NASCAR superstar Denny Hamlin has an interesting link to Milwaukee. After qualifying his cup car in Sonoma, he flew here, but his helicopter couldn't find a spot to land at the Milwaukee Mile. So the 2007 AT&T 250 Bush Series race winner is credited to Eric Almirola, even though he was taken out of the car for Hamlin. We'll let him explain the strange and incredible story. It was just, just such a crazy night. What do you recall about that now, like 14, 15 years later? I don't know why the flight was delayed to begin with. I'm not really sure what happened or why we arrived later. We still got there, or I, I, I was um, uh, getting there right as kind of national anthem was going on. And so I, evidently the track had parked cars on the helicopter pad, and I – so the, the, the helicopter guy was like, well, I, I got nowhere to land. So we had to land 20 minutes up the road, drive. And by the time we got there, they were doing the pace laps to, to start the race. And so I'm like, all right, well, I just traveled all this distance for nothing. I, I'm just going to sit on the pit box and be a cheerleader. And so I remember my crew chief at the time, Dave Rogers, sent a note saying, well, the sponsor wants you in. I'm like, oh, boy. You know, I'm like, I don't, I don't think so. I don't, I don't want to do it. And they said, listen, as long as he keeps the lead, then, then he'll, we'll keep him in. But if he loses the lead, then, then they were going to pull him out. And so um, he lost the lead. I think he fell back to third or something on one of the runs and uh, they changed him the next pit stop and I got in and went. Racing history and great stories just ooze from Wisconsin, don't they? Lance Allen, TMJ4 Sports.